As we know, COVID-19 has amplified and accelerated inequalities, especially against women and girls. From violence to increased share of unpaid care work to the brunt of the potential $3 trillion economic loss in the region. Immediately, UN Women in Asia Pacific has realigned and repurposed its efforts across the triple mandate to ensure our response to the pandemic benefits all women and girls. With billions of people still sheltered at home, many women are isolated with abusive partners and are unable to access life-saving help. To address this, we have joined hands with Twitter to provide information about helpline services for survivors of violence and to make sure that they access these services. This prompt is currently available in Thailand, India, Indonesia, Malaysia, the Philippines, Singapore, South Korea and Vietnam. I'm also very excited to share with you about an initiative which has been building momentum which proves that we are walking the talk. The production of two million masks by women, for women and the frontline workers. With production lines in Myanmar, Cox Bazaar, Afghanistan and Nepal, we are empowering women by providing livelihoods and personal protective equipment. We will continue to ensure that our response and that of our partners, first and foremost, places the voices, needs and agency of women at the heart of our response and recovery.